Hello everyone, welcome to Agriculture Insight. Did you know that the world produces over 143 million pounds of chamomile each year? Chamomile is not just a flower that brings gentle beauty and a soothing fragrance. It's also a precious ingredient used to create delicious herbal teas and high-quality essential oils that help relax the mind and improve sleep. Join us as we explore the journey of chamomile from vast, endless fields where each bloom is carefully harvested using the most advanced machinery to preserve its natural flavor and exceptional quality. From there, the flowers are transported to high-tech factories where they are transformed into perfect products ready to meet your every need. Now, let's step into the gentle and calming world of chamomile. Chamomile is known for its delicate white petals and vibrant yellow centers, giving off a gentle, soothing fragrance that brings a sense of relaxation and calm. Chamomile typically takes about 8 to 12 weeks to grow before it's ready for harvest. When summer arrives, you can witness vast chamomile fields where advanced machinery is used to harvest the flowers with incredible efficiency and precision. These modern machines allow farmers to work quickly while preserving the quality of the blooms. The machines are specially designed with ultra-sharp cutting blades at the front. As they move across the fields, the blades cut the flowers cleanly at the base, ensuring every chamomile bloom is harvested neatly without damaging the surrounding plants or leaves. Right after cutting, the flowers are gently lifted onto an integrated conveyor belt within the machine. The conveyor smoothly transports the blooms to large collection bins at the back, where they are safely stored and ready to be transported to processing facilities. Using modern machinery to harvest chamomile not only boosts efficiency but also reflects significant advancements in agriculture. First and foremost, these machines greatly reduce the need for manual labor, which is crucial as the agricultural workforce becomes increasingly scarce. Instead of harvesting each flower by hand, modern machinery can cover large fields quickly, saving both time and labor for farmers. Not only that, using machinery also helps increase productivity and lower production costs, giving American farmers a competitive edge in the global market. At the same time, it promotes sustainable development as the harvesting process is carried out quickly, minimizing waste and protecting the environment. The combination of modern technology and traditional farming expertise has transformed chamomile harvesting into an efficient process, ensuring high-quality products reach consumers. After being harvested from the vast fields, chamomile flowers are transported by truck to the factory and promptly moved into drying chambers to preserve their freshness and quality. Workers use specialized tools to evenly spread the flowers onto drying trays, ensuring that every bloom is exposed to heat evenly. Inside the drying chambers, temperature and humidity are carefully controlled, typically maintained at 35 to 45 degrees Celsius, allowing the flowers to dry evenly while retaining their natural fragrance and color. This drying process lasts between 6 to 12 hours, preparing the flowers for the next stages of processing. After the drying process is complete, chamomile flowers are transferred to a specialized separation system that separates the flowers from the stems and leaves. The machine uses gentle air currents and precision blades to automatically sort the materials, ensuring the flowers maintain their shape and remain undamaged. Smaller pieces like stems and leaves are sent to a separate compartment for further processing or used as organic fertilizer. The chamomile flowers are then moved onto an automated conveyor belt for manual sorting by skilled workers. On the conveyor, workers carefully inspect each flower by hand, removing any that are crushed or damaged. This process requires great attention to detail and focus to ensure only the highest quality flowers are selected. After manual sorting, the chamomile flowers are transferred to vibrating machines designed to grind them into fine chamomile powder. These machines mimic a gentle sifting motion, similar to the process of milling flour, to ensure the flowers are evenly processed. The vibration helps break down the dried flowers into a consistent powder while separating any remaining larger particles. The resulting fine powder is then collected and prepared for packaging or further processing into various chamomile-based products. 
as well as they are packed in different packaging for the convenience of consumers. Besides being used to make tea, chamomile is also utilized to produce essential oil through steam distillation. In this process, fresh or dried chamomile flowers are placed in a distillation chamber, where steam passes through to extract the essential oil. The oil is then condensed, separated from water, and filtered to ensure its purity. Chamomile oil is commonly used in shampoos to soothe the scalp, reduce dandruff, and nourish the hair, leaving it soft and healthy. They are packaged into shampoo bottles on automated conveyor belts, ensuring a fast, precise packaging process that maintains product quality. It's not just chamomile. Lavender is also a symbol of relaxation and a valuable ingredient for creating exceptional products. Let's continue our journey to discover how farmers harvest and transform lavender into high-quality products. Creating stunning lavender fields starts with the careful process of propagation. Farmers can choose to plant seeds or use strong cuttings taken from mature parent plants, placing them in soft, nutrient-rich soil. These young plants are nurtured in greenhouses, providing the perfect environment for healthy growth. Over time, the tiny green sprouts grow steadily, carrying the promise of a breathtaking lavender season. It's the farmer's patience and attentive care that allow lavender to thrive, weaving the dreamy landscapes we can't help but fall in love with. Before planting lavender seedlings, Farmers start by plowing the soil to break up compacted layers, loosen it, and remove any weeds. Then, they carefully level the ground, ensuring a smooth and even surface, perfectly prepared for planting. Next, semi-automated planting machines come into play. These machines have seats at the back where farmers sit, holding seedlings from trays, and gently placing them into the freshly tilled soil at precise intervals. Behind the machine, other farmers follow, carefully covering the roots with soil to secure the plants and provide a firm base for them to grow strong and healthy. Lavender typically reaches its peak bloom in summer, between June and August, depending on the variety and local climate. This is when the flowers are at their most fragrant and contain the highest concentration of essential oils. The ideal time to harvest is either early in the morning or late in the afternoon, when temperatures are cooler, to prevent the precious oils from evaporating. Farmers carefully inspect each plant to ensure they harvest at the perfect moment, when about 50 to 70% of the flowers on each stem are in full bloom. Harvesting lavender is not just an agricultural task, it's an art, a harmonious collaboration between people and nature to bring home bundles of beautifully scented purple blossoms. Timing and precision in the harvesting process are key to ensuring the highest quality flowers. Before the advent of machinery, lavender was harvested entirely by hand, requiring precision and care. Farmers used small sickles to cut each bundle of flowers gently gathering and tying them into small bunches for drying or distillation. This traditional method is still practiced in certain regions to preserve the natural fragrance and beauty of the flowers. As hand harvesting gradually gave way to technological advancements, lavender fields began to see the arrival of modern harvesting machines. These machines have become indispensable for large-scale farms, where lavender is cultivated across vast expanses of land, sometimes covering tens of hectares. 
They not only save time and labor, but also ensure that the flowers are handled with care, maintaining their quality throughout the harvesting process. On expansive lavender farms, where rows of purples stretch endlessly, automated harvesting machines are the go-to solution. These machines are designed much like grain harvesters, equipped with advanced sensors that precisely determine the height of the flower rows. This allows the machine to cut only the blooming flower stems while leaving the lower leaves and stems intact, ensuring the plants can continue to grow. Once cut, the flowers are transported via a large conveyor belt, passing through a preliminary sorting mechanism before being collected in a massive storage container at the back of the machine. These containers can hold hundreds of kilograms of flowers, reducing the need for frequent trips and saving valuable time for the farmers. For lavender fields dedicated to essential oil distillation, specialized machines that both cut and process flowers on site are widely used. These machines go beyond simply cutting, they can grind the flower heads right in the field. The ground lavender is then transferred directly into large containers, ready to be sent to distillation facilities without the need for additional processing steps. These machines are praised for their efficiency and ability to preserve the maximum amount of essential oil from the flowers. With a design focused on gentle handling, they ensure the flowers' structure remains intact, resulting in the highest quality essential oil during the distillation process. Modern harvesting machines not only boost productivity but also minimize losses during the harvest process. With the help of advanced technology, farmers can efficiently and quickly gather lavender, maximizing the value of their vast purple fields. In addition to increasing efficiency, technology plays a vital role in preserving the natural ecosystem in lavender-growing regions. The precision of these machines ensures minimal soil disturbance, reducing erosion, and maintaining the land's health for future cultivation. After harvesting, lavender is transported to the factory for essential oil extraction. Below is the entire process of making lavender essential oil, from pressing the oil to bottling the final product, ready to be delivered to consumers. The process of extracting essential oil from lavender begins with steam distillation. The steam containing the essential oil is then directed through a condenser, where the temperature is reduced and the essential oil separates from the steam. After condensation, the pure lavender oil is collected in a container, while the leftover water containing other compounds is separated. After the lavender essential oil is extracted and filtered, it is transferred to an automated bottling line. Clean glass bottles are fed into the system, where the oil is precisely dispensed into each bottle by automatic filling machines. Once filled, the bottles are inspected to ensure there are no cracks or impurities. Ne Next, the bottle caps are automatically screwed on, and each bottle is labeled with product information, ready for distribution to consumers. Thank you for joining us on this journey to explore the process of turning fragrant flowers into premium herbal teas and essential oils.
If you have any questions or thoughts, feel free to leave a comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more fascinating stories about the world of agriculture. Goodbye, and we'll see you in the next video.